Ignite is an ongoing series of speedy presentations. They range from building multi-person pogo sticks to hacking chocolate. Any topic the geeks hold dear. Each speaker gets only five minutes and 20 slides at auto advance every 15 seconds. The talk you're about to hear was recorded live at one of the featured Ignite events around the world. Um, so next up we have another great look into Reno. Uh, next up is Harold Paulson. Uh, he's a developer in town here. How many people have heard of Hack for Reno? Okay, bunch of hands, awesome. So Harold's gonna be talking a little bit about a project that was built at Hack for Reno this year and how it's going to hopefully, you know, improve and change Reno. So Harold. Thank you. All right. Uh, everybody knows what Wikipedia is. It's like the best thing on the internet, basically. Uh, but it's not the only wiki, and it wasn't even the first wiki. Uh, the uh, the basic idea of a wiki is it's a it's like a website where you add some programming to it, so you can uh, so like anyone can change it. You can go in there and you can edit pages. You can add pages. So they built Wikipedia as as one of those wikis that uh, w would be an encyclopedia, which is like an obviously stupid idea, because if people who don't know what they're talking about are adding articles. And people who can't write are adding just impenetrable to read articles, you end up with something really terrible. But that's obviously not what happened. Because uh, a wiki is a, a system for like iteratively amassing and improving knowledge. So even if you start with a really terrible article, even if it's just garbage, someone will go in and see it, and they'll be an expert, and it will offend them, and they will fix it. It's just like Darwinian evolution, you know? A lot of little changes add up over time to make something that's more fit. So last December, as Colin said, we had a hack for Reno, and my friend Donica Mansing and I, we built uh, uh, renosparkswiki.org. And uh, it, uh, we installed uh, uh, local wiki, uh, which is a uh, Code for America project. It's an open source thing. Code for America is this... Uh, a uh, new nonprofit that hooks web generation type programmers up with uh, cities and governments to build like reusable software. So it's this, it's this open source program that we installed so that uh, we, you know, it's a, a wiki for a town that's like really tightly integrated with maps. So uh, Wikipedia is awesome, but uh, it has two problems that were great for it, but a problem for us because uh, it has uh, uh, a, a standard of notability. Like, uh, Kiol is an awesome bar, but it's not important enough to be on Wikipedia, unfortunately. And also Wikipedia has, has uh, uh, standards of, uh, of tone. So everything you put in there has to be a fact, and ideally it has to be backed up with a source, a reference. But there's important information, important knowledge that uh, may not be important enough for an encyclopedia, and important opinions or consensus about stuff. I mean, there's like 10,000 people in Reno who know uh, what a good sushi restaurant is in town. I don't eat that shit, so I don't know. <laughs> and if I wanted to know, I don't have any way to find out because it's all trapped in your brains. Uh, you know, I can't get at it. And uh, there's marketing. Uh, Kiel has a website, but it's marketing. So it's good for finding out when happy hour is, but if you want an opinion about it, it's not trustworthy because it's marketing. So we built uh, Reno Sparks Wiki and uh, a .org, and we encourage everyone to go out there, sign up, and make a, a, just a terrible article to get started. <laughs> because it will get better, and someone will fix it, and we'll end up with this huge resource of all the knowledge, all the bars, all the restaurants, all the parks, all the uh, uh, organizations that are in town, and eventually what we're really interested in in the future is hooking it up into a sweet mobile app so that when you walk out of Kiol at two in the morning, you can pull open your phone and look at the app and see what are the eateries within walking distance, highly regarded by locals, uh, that are open that late. <laughs> so uh, you might notice the slides have nothing to do with the talk because Donica was supposed to give it, but she had to run out of town in an emergency. So um, uh, 
I encourage you to uh, go to RebusSparksWiki.org and, uh, and please add an article. If you're out with a phone, take a picture of what you see and, uh, and uh, uh, make it something awesome for our town. Thanks a lot. <laughs>